This is Eric Mwad with Mother.com with a weekend market analysis for September 28th and 29th, 2019 with about one minute to go before the market close. Markets are slightly down for the day of their lows. Let's take a look at those charts when we begin as we always do with the S&P 500. And we're going to begin here with the weekly. We can see after this week's action, the market is down slightly. S&P 500 is down about a percentage point. We can see here now that we can consider what it looks like based on the prior breakout attempt. And that level that we were watching was 3000. 25.86 which is this weekly closing high from the month of July 2019. So right now we can see and conclude that yes there is the closing bell and I'll show you the closing numbers here in a bit and we can see here that the market is now pretty much practically showing that it is failing to break out. So we tried here three weeks ago, tried to break out last week, and this week is pulling away from that area. So, of course, failed breakouts are notorious for taking instruments lower. So that becomes a little bit of a problem as far as the bulls are concerned. The only way to cure this is eventually the market finding enough energy to move above 3,025.86. Now, bears should be encouraged now that the market has given us this failed breakout attempt and as long as that's the case that's a reason to actually have some short positions in play because of that failed breakout and the other thing we've been talking about is the rsi top side line on the weekly for the s p 500 continues to be a level that has been giving us some guidance and here we can see it is struggling to hold the RSI topside resistance. What that means is if this market is to go higher, we need a price breakout. We need the RSI to clear this RSI topside resistance.